Okay, Drew. Uh, how did the hike go today? It was good. Besides a lot of waiting for me. Um, yeah, it was pretty good. Nice and slow. <laughs> nice and slow. Slow and low. You had to actually extend the, extend the hike because yeah, I was so slow and farther, messing so your like your, your whole flow up, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, first off, great shirt. How was the shirt today? Did it, it sweat? Good. Did it show no, some? No, I didn't break a sweat. You did? Well, you cut some letters on the back. Yeah. You yeah. just have to trust us. There yeah. were. There were. Okay. So let's talk. We got UFC tonight, but let's talk college choices, right? Last summer we talked when I was here. You actually picked me up from the airport. But now um, you picked a school. You picked yep. a school, right? Yep. Minnesota. Why Minnesota? Um, you know, I think uh, that the um, programs just got like what I need in terms of partners. They got a great RTC. Um, and then especially guys around my weight, you know, Great and Lee, obviously the big one. Um, and then the coaches and uh, facility are uh, top tier too. Where do they have you projected? Like right now they're talking whatever, you know, like 49, 57, whatever yep. you may be. But when you're projecting a situation like that, it's a situation where you might have to wrestle like a Braden Lee off. Yeah. Is that something you're looking for? Yeah. Yeah, you know, um, I think if you go um, maybe don't have as tough a competition, um, you kind of don't wrestle up, you know, higher to your abilities. And, you know, when you get pushed in uh, – in the room like that against against those guys um then you gotta improve or you're not gonna get the spot so your dad was an assistant coach from minnesota probably 15 years ago i want to say yeah i think in i think in 06 05 06 04 05 06 something yeah. like that right now yeah. right so you, you look at that and you guys already have a past relationship with, the, mm -hmm. with minnesota um is that something where he knows those coaches and you felt more comfortable in the situation what, what, what was how instrumental was your dad in it? Did your dad stay out of it? How, how was that? Um, well, yeah, he stayed out of it um, for sure. You know, he did not he didn't get involved into it. Um, you know, if I needed advice, he, he's obviously been in um, college wrestling for a long time. So, you know, he uh, he could give me that advice. But, um, no, he stayed out of it. And then as far as the coaches, um, you know, I just, I just really liked him. Felt like I connected with him. Um, and, uh, you know, actually Brandon, um, the head coach was, was my babysitter, um, for, for a couple times. <laughs> so he used to small, watch you as a little yeah, kid, small world, you know, I don't remember it. I was really young, you know, uh, cause I was born in Coeur d'Alene, uh, and then I think I was like maybe three or four. So, um, moved out there and then. And then we moved to uh, Oregon State when my dad got the job there. So you've actually lived in Minneapolis, right around Minneapolis metro mm -hmm. area, Minneapolis, St. Paul metro area, mm -hmm. uh, Coeur d'Alene and Spokane, Coeur d'Alene, and now, uh, uh, or then it was uh, Corvallis, right? Yeah. You guys actually yeah. lived in Corvallis, did, yeah. just right outside. Mm -hmm. So now now you're heading back where you were as a little kid. Yep. Did it just make sense to you when you looked at the facilities and the workout yeah, partners you know. and the academics and... It's a it's a flight away. It's a two hour flight mm -hmm. away. It's not bad. You know, it's not a whole travel day. You know, like East Coast would have been a tough. That would have mm -hmm. been tough, right? You no, know, it's far. Um, and then you know, style wise, I think my style matches up with you know, go for tradition. You know, push the pace, wrestle hard. Um, so that was another big thing too. But um, yeah, I mean, as far as uh, traveling distance, you know, it's it's uh, pretty close. So um, being on the West Coast. Okay, so go for go, Golden Gophers, go Gophers! Mm -hmm. I like that. I'm excited. I'll probably have to come and catch a dual meet or something mm -hmm. with your dad. I know he's really excited about just being a dad mm -hmm. and being a fan. Yeah, he's never been that, has he? No, no. He's been been a coach his whole life, so be nice for him to. I mean, even now, like he still coaches me, so um, you know it'll be it'll be definitely different for him. All right. The one thing I want to get out of you is one more track season. Can we get a track season out of you? You know, I I was trying out this year and then COVID. Uh, COVID, so we'll uh we'll see it. We'll Eight, hopefully 800, see it this year. 1600 what yeah, will be? Yeah, um 3200? What do you guys have? Do you have 800 1600? Um Cuz Oregon had 1500, didn't it? Yeah, Oregon's a little different, so yeah. they they do Olympics, so it's 1500. Um Washington or I mean uh Washington and Idaho do uh, 
I think it's sixteen hundred. Sixteen hundred. And then a mile's sixteen hundred nine yeah. meters. But yeah. So it's it's basically a mile. What was your fastest fifteen hundred? What's your what are you've probably done both? Um, what's your fastest times in that? Fifteen. Um, I didn't run it. I never got to run it. My fat like I always held back because um, we were kind of tapering. Um, but what was your fastest even like? Even if it was training runs or just like slower uh, competition, I think four ten. Four, so you run a four four ten fifteen hundred. Yeah, and so then what sixteen hundred? You probably run right four twenty four twenty five twenty five four twenty five in a relay. My fast mile is four twenty six. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. And then you got uh, me by two then, seconds. It's pretty and good. And then I was I was supposed to uh, I was supposed to run at the end of the year, but I. Uh, tore my glute and some hip muscles so so you you I might so. try and come up for the spring quarter lane high yeah run a little track mm -hmm. you know that's all i want i yeah. just want, i mean can't mile, you just do the state series can't you just do the state series when they yeah, let you do that mile 800 you know four by four maybe it's we'll only see. like three races yeah. maybe three or four races yeah i love it fastest uh 5k uh 1552 and, and that was on a course yeah that wasn't a road race no no, it's really I, uh, fast, yeah, man. It was, it was uh, at the time, which was two years ago, um, they changed the course. But on that course, it's fastest freshman um, record ever ran. It was in Oregon. Yeah. Was, was that was, at the state meet? State, state it was meet. a state meet. Yeah. And it was a mutter, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, it was pouring rain. Wow. It's so fast. Um, uh, you know, you look at your body, it's changed a little bit. You know, you probably did that at 150. 120 pounds 125 yeah, about pounds 120 120 because you won the state that year at 106 13 at 13 yeah sorry you won the state that year at 13 you probably weighed 120 125 right mm -hmm. your body's changed now you're almost 160 pounds will yeah. that affect i mean i i have to assume yeah that's going to affect your distance running yeah um you know i haven't ran a cross country race since uh since my freshman year fall of my freshman year so where you ran a 1550 yeah or well, actually, uh, that was I ran, I ran in my sophomore year, and then I and then I fractured my uh, tibia. I got a stress fracture on my tibia, but um, I haven't ran like my fastest since then. But but I wasn't I wasn't s slower my sophomore year. Well, I was because I had a fractured tibia, and, yeah. and then I found out. But um, you know, I wasn't a whole lot bigger then. But now I'm a lot bigger than those two years. So. Um, yeah, I I think that's like kind of why I want to go down to eight hundred if I run. When's the last time you just went out for a run and we're just like and just got it, just a two miler or a four miler or whatever it was and just got it. Uh, it's been a while. So you you got to get yeah. kind of back in there yeah. and get that feel. Yeah, I mean I haven't ran like a like a fat. I haven't ran really like my fastest like a race since uh, sophomore year. Yeah. Wow. Was and it was you were injured. Mm -hmm. When's the last time you wrestled like a hard? hard got pushed not your dad when's the last time you wrestled another high school kid and got pushed real hard was it was it december was it january when was it yeah probably so it's been like nine months mm -hmm. going on nine months yeah wow um what preseason tournaments for you this year i, I okay barring having yeah. the tournaments what preseason tournaments what um, what season tournaments or what preseason we'll probably have to look at the calendar but you know probably uh super 32 um, you know, try to get out to that. We didn't go to that last year. And then obviously the two seasons before that, cause cross country. Um, and then last year we just weren't training enough. And so we were like, it's not worth it to go out. You know, if we're not, not fully prepared, so we didn't go out, but hopefully super 32 this year. And, um, you know, we'll look at the calendar and see. Iron man. You're back at Iron man. Yep. It, it, you know, you bearing know, the they right? have it. Yep. Yeah. And then Definitely. what's the big one? Do you, get, do you guys go to Tri-State out here? Yeah, Tri-State. And then Rocky and Mountain. Rocky Mountain. Uh, Raleigh. Raleigh's like our, the big tournaments around here for us, yeah. Those are some good tournaments, man. Mm -hmm. Even for Western. Could you potentially swap out Reno for something? Yeah. Uh, what would you have to swap out Reno for? I think Tri-State. Tri-State. So that kind of don't want to do that. Yeah. Because um, it's home. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's home. It's 10 minutes from, from our high school, so um that's tough that'd be tough mm -hmm. to do i don't know if i could do that you know a flight for a 10 minute yeah. drive i don't know if i can do that and you're getting good competition what weight this year uh iron man 45 
Um, Super 32? Super 32, 45, yeah. And then would you go the rest of the season 52, do you think? Yeah, most likely. And you're getting up to 60, that's good. Um, thing you're most excited about about Minnesota, being a Golden Gopher? Um, you know, just being around uh, great guys that have the same goals as me and, uh, you know, improving my wrestling and, uh, you know, being the best I can be. Okay. Your mom and your dad. I love your mom and your dad. Okay. Your mom's an angel. She's a saint. Mm -hmm. Let's just put that put it that way. Love your uncles. Right? What's your favorite thing about, like, you're going to be out of here? You're gone and you're going to be gone in the spring. Okay. What are you going to miss the most about Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, Spokane, Washington, Pacific Northwest? What are you going to miss most about moving, you know, you're going to go to the Midwest? What are you going to miss most about this place? Um, you know, just the, I mean, it's beautiful here. Uh, you've seen it. Um, you know, um, it's awesome, but, uh, you know, probably, uh, probably my mom, my mom's help. <laughs> <laughs> That's what yeah. you're going to miss the most? Yeah, probably, you know, <laughs> the laundry and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got to grow up, buddy. All right. You got anything else for me? Can you get the old man yet? Yeah. Can you get him? Yep. When was the last time you got him? Where? Give me, lay, lay it out for me. Let's go. I want to hear it. Probably, probably a month ago. Where was it? Uh, in a little shop, like, uh. It's 45 minutes from here. We've been wrestling. So you guys scrap it out. What was the go? Um, as long as he can last. So you just went. Would you blast double him? Did you hard hands him? What would you do to him? Um, I try not to use my hands too much because he, he's old. And <laughs> I can't wait for him to watch this. Uh, he's, you know, he's, he's, in, I mean, he's, Did you, he's got you, the wear and tear. You, but, wear, uh, you weigh more than him. Yeah. You can hurt him. Yeah. Then you won't have a workout partner. Yeah. Are you thinking that a little bit? Yeah. He's 47. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to hurt him, so. Oh, um, I love it. <laughs> but, I mean, if he gets on top, he can he can throw the legs in. Puts stuff. it on you. Yeah, but he's he's still got old man strength. But you got and, him. You finally stuff. got him. Yeah. How's that ride home? He's he's accepted it, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. I love it. All right, you got anything else for me? Favorite yeah. sibling? I don't know if we can talk about that. <laughs> I love your your brothers and sister. Your brother and your sisters are great. Yeah. I love yeah. it. It's awesome. All right. Thank you for the time. Good luck. Hopefully we get up there and check a dual meet out, all right? Yeah. All right. Let's go watch some UFC, Drew.